My name is Rachel Atchis. I am a Nigerian artist based here in Vancouver, BC. And what is the name of your mural? My mural's name is Mefohunja Mata, which means the female hunter or huntress, um, translated to English uh, from Hausa, which is a language spoken in Nigeria. I love it. Um, in three words, describe your artistic style. Um, I would describe it as sensual, feminine, and ethereal. Now beyond painting, what brings you joy? Um, I would say music brings me the most joy. Um, I love listening to a bunch of different genres and different moods and lots of different playlists. Yeah. What kind of music are you listening to this week? Um, lots of Bjork. <laughs> Bjork. Quirky. Yeah. I like it. Um, <laughs> If you could live anywhere in Canada, where would it be? Um, Montreal for its awesome, rich art scene um, and very low rent. If you weren't an artist, what would you be? I'd probably be a psychologist or a counselor. Oh, I like that. Can you give me some advice after this? Maybe, um, I don't know. I'm still trying to take my own. <laughs> fine space to be in. Uh, why does representation matter in art? Um, representation matters because, I don't know, I feel like the powers that be don't want marginalized folk to have space. They don't want us to have, to tell our stories. And if we don't tell our stories, they just get erased. They just, you know, just they just get completely washed over by the larger narrative. So it's really important for us to have space, no matter where we are and to tell our stories as authentically as possible. It's powerful. Um, we're at your mural. <laughs> tell us a little bit about what it represents. Yeah, um, I would say that my mural represents being completely dedicated to yourself, no matter what's going on below you, um, hyper-focusing on your goals despite distractions, and tapping into a higher form of yourself, the best version of yourself.